In this lesson, we're going to talk about a tool that you've probably already discovered on your own. It doesn't take long before you notice that if you hover over an entity, AutoCAD will display a pop-up that tells you a little bit about the object. This is called a rollover tooltip, and we can use these to get information about the entities in our drawing. For instance, let's hover over this wall. Notice AutoCAD tells me what this object is, as well as some general property information. Now, if you're not seeing rollover tooltips, it's because the feature's turned off on your system. Let me show you where you can go to turn it back on. We're going to visit our options, so I will right-click, we'll come down and select Options, and if we go to the Display tab, there is a checkbox right here that allows us to turn our rollover tooltips on and off. I'm going to leave mine on, and we'll click OK. Using this tool is a lot like interrogating your drawing. What layer is this on? It's on the countertop layer. Is this stool a block? Yes, it is. How about my stove? Is this a block? No, it's not. It's obviously a polyline. And these guys are individual circles. Since I'm not actually selecting my geometry, this is a fast way to get information. Now, rollover tooltips do have a flaw, and it has to do with text. Specifically, text that was created using a true type font. Watch this. Let me place my cursor on this text and notice there's no tooltip. In fact, I can hover in here all day long and they'll never show up. If you're dealing with a true type font and you want to see your tooltips, you have to hover slightly outside the text. I know it seems odd, but once you understand the tool's weakness, it's pretty easy to work around. The beauty of the rollover tooltip is that you can get information without having to select your geometry. Because of this, rollover tooltips can be the fastest way to review your drawings. 